All right, guys, here we go. We're about to meet RJ Anderson. RJ Anderson gets He's going to try and send it out. RJ Anderson going to take the Granite World Cup Challenge win. He has my Pro Light trophy truck in there. Let's go see what it looks like. Just like I racing my little custom number four. Dude, I'm so pumped. Yo guys, how do I look? Guys, what do you think? We'll get some B-roll footage of the truck right now. Tell me what you think. This thing is dope. I'm so pumped. Yeah, this is gonna be a cool video. I kept telling you guys. Better subscribe. But so how do you shift this thing? So it's super easy. It's manual, but you don't have to, you don't have to look when you shift this thing. So one, two, three. And you only use first at the start. So that's literally all you do. Yes, on the right. <laughs> yep, so like literally when you're out like on the track, you just, you leave the miss gate right here. So you're just, yeah, back and forth. Yep, that's it. When was the first time, like, when did you decide, I'm gonna get a pro light? Uh, 2018, when I went to Crandon in 2019 and I saw how cool it was. Oh, and I was on Racing Junk, looking a couple weeks later, and I saw RJ Anderson's truck. When I went to Cranon, I think in 2019, you won, right? Yeah, you won the World Cup. I saw some lady posted it, I messaged her, I told her I wanted to buy it on Facebook Marketplace, I think, and the rest is history from there. We were driving to Cranon. I actually took this to Cranon. On the way, my girlfriend put it on Facebook. I had to give her a little bit of credit because my girlfriend ended up selling the Pro Light. She knew nothing about it, so he like, started asking her questions. She was like, I, so I got a, I got a, I got a fish, you know, it's like a fisherman that didn't know how to get it off the hook. So. Dude, I can't believe we're actually here right now, like Glen Helen. About to drive a truck. This is gonna be awesome. And I've never been to Glen Helen. I've heard a lot about it, but never been. There it is, guys. Feel the speed. I wonder if that's a trophy truck track. That's exactly what that is. It looks very dry, guys. It looks a little, I don't know if anybody can see the dust. Yeah, Let's I don't see. know if you guys can see all that, but it's about 100 foot in the air. Oh my God. Yeah, it's all dusty. It's literally dry. Oh yeah. This is terrible practice. <laughs> <laughs> you can't see any of the track. No, and it's so dry. Yo, he almost just hit the wall. Two. There, that was good. <laughs> Let's, are you ready, uh -oh. big boy? Uh -huh. Let's get it. supposed to move it much Whoa. at all. <laughs> that might be, is that good? You don't want to move much at That's all. That's like. <laughs> yeah, you're in the truck.
How is it? <laughs> Honestly, it's the exact same as I racing. Really? Just the only difference is obviously you, it's a little intimidating to just hold it wide open off jumps. It's honestly so simple. Like obviously I'm not going as fast as RJ. This The scary part is, is like going from second, the top of second to third, holding the wheel with one hand. Like I just don't know it enough to what it's gonna do. So I get like, oh sh <laughs> Guys, I stopped the camera. Gosh, man, I suck at this. This is why I need Coulter. Man, this thing is sick. I have a lot of respect for everybody who drives these trucks and uh, I have a lot of respect for this truck because it has a ton of power and I know it can get out of control quick. So we're just taking our time. The track is super slick and like if you blow a little wide the K-rail, a concrete wall, you'll hit it before you know it. So I'm trying to avoid that. But yeah, it was super fun uh, driving this thing for the first time. We're about to go out for the second drive. the most part guys I told you that K rail was haunting me I bumped it I didn't slam it so we're all good I'm gonna call it a day I felt like today was a great day uh, the first one I was just driving the truck and then over the finish line I started getting a little sideways one time my arm got stuck in between the seat and the, the cage and I couldn't turn but that's all right at least we're not racing yet so I can't make that mistake in one week but yeah I had a really fun day I hope all you guys enjoyed the truck content. Uh, it's really cool that I was able to get that truck and be able to drive it. Shout out to all you guys. I love you guys so much. If you can, like this video and share this with all your buddies. And if you want, you can subscribe to my channel. Peace out.